I'm Stephen Turner. I teach in the English department and I teach writing studies, also in the area of New Zealand studies, uh, which is, involves um, settler colonial studies and indigenous studies. The writing studies, which is a development of English, um, and settler colonial slash indigenous studies might seem like different things. But um, when a new country is settled, um, it has to be written for it to exist. So people in a new country need to understand that they live in one, and in this case it's New Zealand. So somebody has to write a story about what New Zealand is. Um, this is how a country gets written, and it's made over by the writing of it. So I'm interested in how that happens as a process of settlement. But I also teach, um, and it's not separate from that, writing studies, which people tend to think about as being helping people to write better but it's about what writing actually is as an object. So we study it in writing studies. And I mean, if you, if you step outside, if we're talking about writing, everything is writing. So there are signs everywhere. You know how to follow the signs. And so this raises a question of literacy. Um, you have this literacy, a cultural literacy, but we don't ordinarily think about the rules and conventions that constitute that literacy. So in writing studies, we get people to think about how they negotiate their environment, how they move around their cultural neighborhood, and what sort of signs are operating when they do that. I go into the classroom with a set of questions, and I get everyone in the classroom to come up with uh, responses to a set of questions. In this way, a classroom then is mobilized collaboratively by students themselves. And there aren't any answers in advance of what they're doing. It's not a matter of delivering knowledge. I'm not there to transmit something to them and they will have got it when they transmit it back to me. Learning is much more important than any kind of knowledge. You can always produce knowledge, but to be able to learn, to know what it feels like to make knowledge or to construct knowledge is much more important than anything you actually sort of do. So learning, learning is really what's at stake. And then they'll be able to, you know, not just um, know something, they'll be able to make knowledge. So I'm there to give them an experience of what learning involves. And I largely do that by um, appearing to learn something in, in front of them or with them. I know that I don't know something. I'm going to learn it right in front of you and then you will see what it is for the first time, even though you know how to do it. So this kind of disassembly is really important, but it's very difficult to construct a class, classroom to get it to, to be that way. But it's a lot more interesting. It feels a lot more like thinking.